The European Commission is telling other EU members to prepare for a possible no-deal Brexit. It wouldn't comment on what was the most likely scenario, but it did say that whatever happens, there's set to be disruption for all. In, in terms of uh, whether there is a likelihood that uh, there will be no deal, I mean, I think what is very clear in today's communication is that we want to be prepared for the two outcomes. We are working uh, very hard for having a withdrawal agreement with the um, uh, United Kingdom. And, of course, we need to be prepared for all eventualities, uh, and this is what leaders have also called for. The UK's new Brexit secretary is holding his first talks with the EU's chief negotiator in Brussels. Dominic Raab took over from David Davis after he quits over the Prime Minister's post-divorce trade plans. Before heading to the Irish border, another core Brexit issue, Theresa May on Wednesday reiterated her position on a no-deal situation. You asked me about the fact that I have said no deal is better than a bad deal. I think that is, I remain by that. I think that is, that is right. Last month, tens of thousands took to the streets of London to demand a final vote on the details of any deal. Westminster and Brussels have reached a transition agreement, but it's yet to be ratified. It all adds up to continuing uncertainty on both sides of the English Channel.